When we moved to Canada, my children joined community sports and the big one was hockey. Like I remember it so clear as day, we pulled up to Walmart and you told us that we were going to be joining hockey and I was like stoked and I was like, no! I just started falling. <laughs> <Sorry, laughs> so he just bought a big sweatshirt and he had his humongous pants. And it was so great because the people, when we started playing, the people of the community started just bringing gear to us, like everyone was so open and everybody was so and welcoming, supportive. and so we didn't actually have to go buy anything. You guys could not erase the smile off your face after that first practice. It was so cool. Yeah, it was a very exciting time in our lives. There was a lot to learn. There was a lot. We laughed a lot. At the end of the season, there was a parent get-together and one of the parents turned around and says, you're doing the guacamole. So I'd never made guacamole. One of the things that I decided to do was we we're always going to have a bottle of ají, which is like a condiment in, well, in Colombia and in South America. That was going to be part of what we'd always eat. The day of the get-together, I had bought the avocados. And so I turned around, I saw the bottle of ahi, I thought, I'm just going to put it in. And that's what we took to the get-together. And people, I was shocked. People were just like blown away. They were, they were actually licking the bowl. I started going to the potlucks or the get-togethers or dinner parties. I always had to bring the guacamole. And people started saying, you need to make it and sell it. And I was like, okay, yeah, no, that's very sweet of you. But the reaction was the same. People just loved it. Oh my God, this tastes so fresh. It's so delicious. So I, I just started making it. Once I came across a, a, a name of somebody in specialty food, so I thought, I better ask somebody who has some knowledge. And through that, I got a gentleman who said, if you make it, I'll sell it. And that's where it all started. The family got very involved. So we do an assembly line. Um, I'd prepare the sauce, and then in the evening, we would all get together. <laughs> I remember that. That was all the of Ocean Park call. Our production line, family production line. Like, always, always in the same feeling. Yeah. Uh, you're, you're the, you were feeling the bottle, right? Yeah. I'd buy the big bags of onions, and my dad and I would sit in the kitchen and peel onions. <laughs> ah, no Look again. at him. <laughs> made in Canada stickers. The Made in Canada stickers. Yeah. Uh, I'd also bring in the bottles. We hand labeled everything. I used to make because I had a little card that was attached to the bottle and that had the recipes of guacamole. So since I, he is unheard of and I had to make it into things that people actually recognize. So everybody knows what guacamole is. And then if you mix ahi with mayonnaise, it's a zesty tartar, which is super delicious. If you mix it with ketchup, it's a seafood sauce. So all those little recipes, I had them on a tag that we hung from the bottle, which is what we want to encourage our customers to do, experiment with it, because you'll be impressed. No matter what you mix it with or what you put it on, you will be impressed.